Food in Islam The food that a person eats reflects his morals and behaviors, and for this reason, God Almighty urges in many Quranic verses to eat good food, including God Almighty's saying, O people, eat of what is on the earth that is lawful and good. He also said, O you who believe, eat of the good things that we have provided you with, and give thanks to God if you are to him. It is worth mentioning in the verses of the Quran that the food is singular. Evidence that forbids a specific type, and in that the Sheikh of Islam Ibn Taymiyyah said, the basic principle in it is the solution for a Muslim who does righteous deeds because God, the highest, only makes good things permissible for the one who uses them for his obedience, not for his disobedience, and he added, and for this reason it is not permissible to seek help from permissible things on disobedience, such as one who gives meat and bread to one who drinks wine on it, and uses it for immorality. Meaning that God, the highest, has permitted the good things of food for his servants so that they can benefit from it, just as it is not permissible for anyone to forbid that which God, the highest, or the messenger prohibits him. Prayers and peace, and what is prohibited are forbidden. Ruling on eating pork God Almighty has legislated many laws and rulings to preserve the interests of people in this world and the hereafter, and to preserve the five interests related to religion, self, reason, honor and money. What a person eats, everything that is good in terms of drink and food is permissible, and as for the evil one, it is forbidden, and in the encouragement of good things and repulsion from the evil, God Almighty said, and the good things are permitted for them and the bad ones are forbidden to them, pork, and the evil foods that are forbidden by Islam. This was reported in many places in the Holy Quran, including the words of God Almighty, rather, the dead, the blood, the flesh of the pink, and what is good for the deception of God with it, as he said, he also said, say, I do not find in what has been revealed to me forbidden for a person who eats it, unless it is a dead body, or shed blood, or a carcass of flesh. Zia was mentioned definitively in all the previous verses, meaning that God, the Most High, did not gradually forbid pigs as he prohibited alcohol. An indication of the severity and size of the harm that pigs cause to humans to eat. And al we also said that, and the pig was called unclean because it used to eat impurities. To the wisdom of that or not, and Ibn Kathir, may God have mercy on him, said in this regard, everything that God Almighty has permitted of good food is beneficial to the body and religion, and everything that he forbids is evil and harmful to the body and religion. Al-Razi also said, the Islamic nation states that the pig in all its parts is forbidden, but God Almighty mentioned meat, because most of the benefit is related to it. Ibn Hazm said regarding the pig it is not permissible to eat anything from the pig, neither its meat, nor its fat, nor its skin, nor its nerves, nor its cartilage, nor its filling, nor its brain, nor its bone, nor its head, nor his limbs, nor his milk, nor his hair, male and female, young and old alike, and it is not permissible to use his hair, whether in beads or otherwise. The Wisdom of Prohibiting Pork Pig causes many diseases and bad behaviors, 
pig blood contains many epidemics, diseases and worms, such as, flatworm, tapeworm, cylinder worm, and spinal worm. The pig is the only animal that is not jealous of its female, and one of the germs in the pig is the Yarsina germ, and it is found only in the pig, and it lives at a very low temperature, and it should be noted that the pig is forbidden by the Jews, and it is forbidden by several Christian sects, because of the many dangers caused by pigs, and diseases related to pigs and spread are the so-called swine flu. Among the diseases caused by pigs, mad cow disease called prions, and it also causes the transmission of many viruses to the human body, including influenza virus, Nipah virus, severe acute respiratory syndrome virus called SARS virus, foot and mouth disease virus, rabies virus, Japanese encephalitis virus, and fever virus Ross River, pig ulcer virus, mouth ulcer virus, encephalitis and heart virus, smallpox virus, yellow fever virus, and the pig causes the transmission of a large number of bacteria to humans, including brucellosis bacteria, salmonella bacteria, leptospirosis bacteria, anthrax bacteria, coli bacteria, yersinia bacteria, colostrum bacteria, skin ulcers bacteria, skin erysipelas bacteria, pulmonary tuberculosis bacteria, pulmonary toxicity bacteria, and septicemia bacteria, and the pig contains many harmful chemical compounds that are incompatible and incompatible with the compounds of the human body, which it causes many diseases to humans.